When I'm telling a non-climber that I'm living in my van, I never know what to expect. Some people, you know, give me the dirty looks. Then other times, you know, people think it's awesome. People think it's great that I'm doing what I want to do, doing what makes me happy, and that makes me proud. This one look, this all that it took, making me weak with every move you make. Living in the van, there's a ton of downtime, you know. I mean, you can only climb so much. I climb five days a week, but even then, you know, you have to find something else to fill your time. Really early on, I went, you know, a few months with not knowing what else to do besides climbing. And it really gets to you. You know, my name is Brandon Gazelle. I'm 21 years old. Uh, I live in my van and I've been on the road off and on for about two years now. Uh, I was a bit surprised because I woke up this morning and it was snowing out quite a bit and dark and cold. But we went up anyways and everything kind of like cleared up and it was perfect weather today. So I was psyched. Yeah, it gets it gets lonely at times, but I've I've learned to embrace the loneliness, I guess. That's the that's one really cool thing about living in the van is that there is a community out there of other people and it's great because I've been in Joe's Valley for like a month or two now and I've met a few people that have also been here for a month or two and after this we're gonna migrate to Bishop. So there's people out there. 